Hey guys, this is Rick from Riri Blocks, and today we have a very special guest, and it's uh, Patty Gurdy from the German National Selection. <laughs> Patty, you already had your rehearsals. Um, how do you feel about them? Wow. Um, you know, when I come off stage from a rehearsal where still maybe some things aren't un unclear yet, not everything is on 100%, also in the background, you know, things I can't affect when I'm on stage. I come off stage and I have so much in my head. It's so hard to sort it out. But then when I see the result on video, it's so much easier for me. So that's when I start getting things in order. And then I'm like, oh, okay, now I know what I, what's going on behind me, what's going on with the cameras, because when you're on there, everything happens so fast. <laughs> so you're a little uh, control free. Uh, I, I guess. <laughs> well, I think I have a high quality standard, mm. of course, but I don't think I'm a control freak. <laughs> mm -hmm. I am very well um, sure about the fact that I am just human too, and everybody participating here is just a human. <laughs> but it's good to take it serious because, uh, of course, it's uh, everything's about the German ticket for Liverpool. Mm -hmm. Why do you think Germany should choose you for this task? Uh, well, yes, it's very exciting going to Liverpool and also seeing so many other countries participate and seeing their performances, which are really, really amazing. <laughs> and uh, I just really hope that I can reach some people with my message, with it, which is about hope and rebirth and getting through hard time and relying that there will be community around you to support you and um, we saw you rehearsing alone on stage some people thought there maybe would be dancers or a band why did you decide to go alone <laughs> well i'm never alone on stage because i have my hurdy-gurdy <laughs> And the thing is just that um, when you're playing with a medieval instrument that not a lot of people know about, a lot of attention goes on the instrument and people are really, they want to see close-ups of the instrument because they want to understand it, right? And I, I have to cherish that. I have to give that the space that it needs. And to be honest, we've never had a hurdy-gurdy on, on the Eurovision stage. So it's about time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it would be a first if people choose you on Friday. So. Mm. And um, speaking of your uh, uh, contenders, is there anyone you would like to see on Liverpool if you would not be the one? So who would you vote for? Sure. Well, honestly, when I watch the others, I just watch them a little bit. There are some where I really say, my God, this is an artist. And uh, one of the people, in my opinion, is Trong, because with his song, he really, it's not just a song or a performance, it's also a safe space. And it's so bubbly and, you know, it's like inviting. And I feel really good when I listen to and, and see his song and performance. So, Patty, um, we, of course, would like to listen to your song. Could you sing a little bit of it? Sure. Um, I will start at my favorite part in, in the song. Don't you worry now. May the wind have your back and the sunlight be warming your day. I sing my melodies of hope. Flowers grow in the barren ground. I see them all around. Only the wind will know. Hear the whispers of far away dreams of a brighter day. Beautiful. Thank you so much. <laughs> and um, do you have a final message for our readers and your new fans in mm -hmm. on the whole world? Basically. Sure. So a message that is very close to my heart is the message message about mental health and a supportive community because I felt that very much. I was a flood victim in 2021 and the German floods, the Atalflut. And uh, back then, my my fan community, the Guardians, they really, really helped me out of the mud, literally. And I'm just realizing now, bringing this topic to the front, how important it is to talk about it. Not not just like for everyone, but also especially for men, because they have a special stigma on top. So the message of mental health is really, really important to me. So I can just say, take care of each other, listen to each other, be good to each other. And that creates a safe community. And I think that's what we need. Thank you so much. We wish you uh, good luck. Have fun on stage on Friday. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>